Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Gianni Diaz and today I am doing a get to know me tag. Um, I have 25 things that I would like you guys to know um, going forward. A just little get to know me tag, whatever. Just some few facts about me that I think are basic and important and essential to knowing who I am and who, you know, is making this channel and whatnot. So if you guys would like to know more about me, just continue watching. So I am in a different background, but today I am on my couch, my comfy, comfy couch. Um, yeah. So I'm just going to get right into the first fact about me. So number one is my name. My full name and legal name is Gianni Diaz. I don't have a middle name. I know, it's kind of crazy. I th I've always wanted a middle name, but I just never got one. None of my siblings have middle names. So, yeah. Um, my name is different. It is unique, I guess you would say. Um, I've never heard anyone with my name. And that is because it is made up. Um, so pretty much when my parents were dating, they decided that for their first child, they wanted to like combine their names together. So I'm going to put it here on the screen, but my name, my mom's name is Anita and my dad's name is Guillermo. So it's Guij de Guillermo and Ani from Anita, Anita and it's Guijani. So that is how my name came about. That's why I don't think you guys have ever heard my name before, but I think it's pretty cool. I, I don't think I would like having a common name. So I do like that my name is unique. So yeah. Also, I am still currently Diaz. Soon I will be um, Gianni Shu. Number two, my nickname is Gigi. Um... I don't remember exactly how my nickname came about, but obviously like a not, not a lot of people could pronounce my name. So they would just call me Gigi. Number three, I am 19 years old. I'm about to be 20 though. Number four, my birthday is April 25th, 2000. So that makes me a Taurus. I was born in the year 2000. Which Number five, I'm 5'2". Most people would say that's a short height, but I feel like it's it's pretty average. Like I don't think I'm, I don't think I'm tall, and I don't think I'm short. So I think I'm just like average height. Number six, I was born in Chicago. I was actually born in downtown Chicago. I love that I was born in Chicago. I just, I will forever, forever, ever, ever love Chicago. Number seven, I grew up in Chicago, um, so I was born in downtown, but then we moved to the, like, suburbs of Chicago, so I was raised in, like, the suburbs of Chicago, but I was very close to Chicago, so I pretty much, you know, say I was, um, grew, I grew up in Chicago, and then, um, I moved when I was 13. Yeah. Number eight, I actually moved to Texas from Chicago at the age of 13 um for just like my dad got like opportunity to work here so we had came here on vacation like a few times and my parents really liked it so they wanted to move over here number nine like I said I am engaged um sorry my nails aren't done but I am engaged to Kareem. But yeah, we got engaged last year on our anniversary, our one year anniversary, we got engaged. I was actually, um, I was not pregnant. I had already had my babies, um, but they were still in the hospital. Um, if you guys want a story time or any, like, if you guys want to find out more about that, just watch my video. It'll be in the description down below. But yeah, so we got engaged on our one year anniversary. So this August 7th will be our second year anniversary and our first year, like our first year anniversary of engagement. So yeah. number 10, I have two beautiful twin daughters. Yes, guys, I have twin daughters. Um, 
it's still surreal to me and crazy but I'm in love like I'm obsessed like I like if you were to tell me in the past that I would have twin daughters I would be like you're playing with me but it's my reality now so yeah I have two beautiful twin daughters named Amaris and Anais nice. and they are and they are currently nine months old 11 I do have both of my parents happily married and then I have one sister and two brothers 12 I am Mexican um to a lot of people that is shocking I guess a lot of people think I'm like Indian or Persian Middle Eastern mix like they just don't know what I am but I'm 100% fully Mexican I know I was born here but by 100% I mean like both my parents are Mexican like my whole family is Mexican type of thing so I'm 100% Mexican. Number 13, my parents are from, so my dad is from Zacatecas and my mom is from San Luis. So yeah. 14, I do speak Spanish and English, obviously. So I do speak two languages and I definitely want, I definitely want my daughters to speak Spanish and English and, um, maybe even learn another language. I would love to learn another language as well. 15, I graduated in 2018 um, and I actually went to um, three different high schools in all my four years. That was probably one of like the hardest things um, because like I'm, I was never like a sociable person. So it was really hard to make like, friends I didn't and go I to school with the people that I was graduating with which I really wanted. 16, so. I did go to college. I actually went to two different colleges. My first semester, I went to the University of North Texas. And then um, the second semester was when I got pregnant. So I went to um, a community college and um, I did only go to to college one year but number 17 I do want to finish school definitely most definitely I don't want to be a statistic where I dropped out because I had kids and I didn't finish school I definitely want to finish school and hopefully become I've always wanted to do something in the medical health professions so um I want to do like either like x-ray or um a sonograph technician i think that would be really cool and like not have to go through a lot of schooling 18 my favorite color is pink if you guys could not tell it is my all-time favorite color like ever since probably elementary school 19 um along with the pink i have a really girly like i guess fashion sense style like that's just my my thing I'm girly I like to dress up I like to do my makeup I love lip gloss I like anything sparkly like glittery pink anything like that that's just me 20 my favorite drink is coke 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 I could drink all day long I know it's bad for you but honestly being a Mexican it's like our holy grail um not to stereotype mexicans but honestly coke is our life and it is for me as well i do like other drinks but coke is definitely like my number one 21 i have never played any sports um the only thing that i can think of that i like tried to get into was um cheerleading when i was very young but i was too shy to like ever dance or anything and then also dance. I did do dance for a little bit, but not like a physical like sports, like soccer or volleyball or anything like that. I'm, I'm, I was never a sporty. Fact 22, the only hobby that I have ever done and like enjoyed doing and stuck to was modeling 23 so um i did at the age of 14 i started um 
quinceanera modeling because I was about to have my quinceanera when I turned 15. So I went to like LA Glitter, um, LA Glitter Designers, if you guys are in the Dallas or Houston area. I modeled since I was 15 to till I was 19. So like now, I recently just had my last show. Um, even with babies, like I was still modeling with them. But yeah, it was it was the greatest time of my life. I really, really enjoyed it and it was something I was very passionate about. 24, to go along with that, I was on three magazine covers. And then the last fact about me, it is that I am an introvert. If you guys, I don't know if you guys could tell or not, maybe not because you know, you assume like if you make YouTube videos that you wouldn't be an introvert, but actually I am very much an introvert. If you were to meet me in real life, like you, I would not be the person to come up to you and say hi or start a conversation. But as the years um, have gone by, and especially with me getting into modeling, um, I have been opening up a little more and just um, being a little more social, but not entirely. I still have my little introvert side where I'm shy. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed listening and um getting to know me a little more stay tuned for my next video because that is when you guys will be able to meet my baby girls so i'm really excited for both of these videos and i hope you guys can like comment and subscribe to my channel so you guys can get more content from me and yeah uh, follow me on my socials you guys and i'll see you guys next time bye